Yang serves as King of Fabul, but even now he trains on a daily basis with his loyal monks. One day his daughter, Princess Ursula, slips away from the castle, traveling to the Mount Hobbs to retrieve her. Yang is shocked to find the Red Wings in the sky, ready to invade his country. Game plus, please. Gang's Tale, the Master of Fabul. <laughs> you dare sit against me? Eat this! <laughs> you call that a punch? Eat this! <laughs> His face is like... Damn. So angry. <laughs> You have to train stronger if you would like to defeat me. Dang. <laughs> this theme song is pretty badass too. You know, it kind of reminds me of like a <laughs> gym leader in Pokemon. That they would have like a theme song like this in their gym. Passable enough, but you need to push yourselves harder. All of you. So I just whooped you with just two kicks. <laughs> King of Fabul, Yang Fang Leiden. We bow to your greatness, Master Yang. Even as king, your prowess has not changed one bit. True strength lies within the heart, not in the body. Have the heart to trust in your companions, and strength will follow each one of you. Father. Dang. <laughs> it's even polygon. It's like... <laughs> see what the level DD they were going for. Yes, Ursula. And she's a blonde somehow. <laughs> Princess of Fabul, Ursula. Please, Father, I beg of you. Allow me to train with you. And of course, Yang's blonde too, but it's interesting because they're supposed to be like Chinese. But, I mean, it's a game, so they can do whatever they want. My answer is firm, my daughter. Well, why not? I may be a princess of this kingdom, but even more than that, I'm a proud citizen of Fabul. Is it so wrong for me to become stronger in mind and body? Well, body. <laughs> you got that, for sure. You have no need to be stronger. Bunny, kick all these perverts asses. I mean, <laughs> but father. M Master Yang. Urgent news, your highness. What is it? Please, let us discuss it in the throne room. Ursula, listen to me. You are the crown princess of Fabul, and you should not forget your position. And neither should any of you. Yes, master. Ursula. <laughs> Shake's head. Alright. the <laughs> previous king. He's like, I'm too old for this shit. It's funny how he still has the like, king's garb and all that. That's Yang's wife. Sheila. I didn't really know her name was Sheila. Ursula again. Yes, Ursula again. I cannot help but wonder where that stubborn streak of hers came from. That'd be you, hon, without a doubt. I might be a little obstinate at times, but I've never held a candle to you. I know, I know. We don't have to go through this again. Pardon me, Master Yang. Ah, my apologies. So then, you have something to tell me. I am not sure how to put this, my liege, but dark shadows seem to be looming over Baron. You must be mistaken. Sisa will never lead his nation awry. Some reports state that several crystals are now in Baron's possession. What? That's preposterous. Your Highness, Duke Consort. Yang is good enough, my Duke. There is no denying the praiseworthy acts you and Sisa performed to save our land. However... However, 
Baron's last ruler was a similarly renowned knight, and still his heart was blighted by evil in the end. I refuse to believe such a thing could happen. Not to Cecil, of all people. Well, to be honest, and actually, it would seem that it would be a recurring thing, because in the previous game, the King of Baron actually got killed and was replaced by uh, Kaznago, something, something, I already can't pronounce the name, the blue turtle-like dude, uh, took his place. And similarly, it could have been that that girl killed Cecil, and now he's being like masqueraded by some who knows what that's being manipulated. But uh, anyways, but if that were not the case, how would one explain why Baron is suddenly gathering crystals again? Both Queen Rosa and Sid are in Baron and would stop such a travesty. What you are proposing is simply too outrageous. Master. The princess has escaped. She wriggled out of the guardsman's ras er, grasp. Not again. Off to Mount Hobbs, no doubt. Let me handle this. But something must be done about Baron, your highness. My trust in Cecil remains firm. And that's the bottom line. <laughs> Let us come along with you, master. Oh yeah. Well then, time to depart. Yes, sir. Yay, you two bucks. I believe they all have the same moveset, right? Just attack and kick, hopefully. That's pretty much all I need. Let's see here. Oh, Yang didn't even grow that much in levels. Okay, that's fine. Let's just get out of here and go. Yeah, I'm sure just being like this much over leveled from, I'm assuming Yang starts at level 10 as well, maybe 15. Um, yeah. Uh, where's Mount Hobbs? Is it this way? I really hope so. Looks like it's the chocobo field. Oh yeah. Mm, 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 mm. I'll probably get a regular chocobo and run there. The white one heals, while the rest of them just are normal chocobos. Chocobo theme song is just a little fun, fun and silly theme song. Where is this Mount Hobbs? Is it way over here? Over yonder? Looks like that is the case. Alright. Push it. I want to see if I can just kick everything to death. Kicking ass now. <laughs> Hiya! And. Oh, dang it. Oh, I don't know much about the dash. Yeah, yeah, what the? I feel like I should probably continue to heal. I do not have a mage at all. I don't think uh, any of my units can heal each other or themselves. So we just gotta be careful. This trail. I don't see a sign of Ursula anywhere. Has she grown strong enough to make it this far on her own? Or has something worse happened instead? No, I mean, we only fought one mob. And we rode a chocobo. This is only been one encounter so far. Kick them all! Ouch. Ouch. Kiku. 
Kick. Kick. Ouch. I feel like Yang may, might be the only one that should be kicking. Because the other monks don't do enough damage to kick well. Interesting that these guys don't have that many levels. I wonder if they reset levels every time. But that doesn't make sense. Because the uh, Kalka dolls, Kalka and Trina, or Brina, didn't do that. Just gonna leave you on kicking. Kicking duty. And the rest of y'all can just attack. But we're probably about to die here. Interesting that these guys are having to level up as if from scratch. Part of myself feels like I should have A grind a little bit, but more importantly B got some items. <laughs> tent. Might even have to use that tent already. Cha -cha. Hiya -hiya. I'm starting to think maybe Yang should just auto-attack. This kick can take too long. He doesn't do that much damage. Yeah, I think I'll just auto attack. It's much faster than kicking. <laughs> I think if his kick like auto killed everything, then I would keep it on kick. But that is not the case. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. So I don't know how long it's going to take. Try to keep it that way. I feel like I should go back and use a tent, to be honest. Maybe it's a key soon. Oh. You want to find some Ursula? You can attack Ursula! Oh, dang. Yeah! Aha! <laughs> Ursula, princess. I feel like she should just auto attack. Yeah, auto attack should be enough. I don't know what chocolate does actually. Ouch. <laughs> I only did 4 damage. So why are we facing all these other monsters that are like kicking my ass? I just kicking the monks' ass at least. Oh yeah, there's another mom bomb. That one's different. There's law. Uh... He's probably getting flashbacks. Stay out of this, father. I've got to these. This won't be as easy before, Ursula. Yep, another mom bomb. The monks are all like <laughs> low energy, low power. Do, 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 do. I wonder if the monks have a band skill with each other. They do. No, they don't. I'm not sure what this does. Oh. I'm not sure what the chakra does, but maybe it heals? I think it does heal, actually, now that I think about it. Yes, it does. I can have her be the healer, then. Maybe that's why she's back there. Oh, no! It's an explosion, but it didn't explode yet. Massive explosion, I should have defended. Uh oh. 
Oh yeah, there's no damage to nobody. Alright, we auto attack him. Usually, we take too long, the bomb starts exploding on you. I mean, that's just your ass. <laughs> oh, yeah. I thought one monk's different from the other, but I guess that makes sense in real life. No two people have the same stats. Father, you foolish girl. Father? Not only did you disobey my express instructions, you blundered deep into the wilderness by yourself. What were you thinking? You have to have some reason. The shooting star. The what? <laughs> what the hell are you talking about? I saw a shooting star fall near Mount Hob several days ago. And you kept this from me? Why? The eyeshadow, though. If I told you, would you have taken me with you to investigate? Sigh. You are right. Now back to the castle. Go on. Please let me go along. I promise I won't do anything rash. No. So you're asking your daughter to venture back through the wilderness all by herself? <sighs> we will gladly protect the princess for you, Master Yang. All right, you win. Whatever you do, just keep yourself out of danger. Absolutely. Princess Ursula has joined the party. Oops. You'd think that, you know, he'd just send the uh, monks away, but the monks are also here for training, so that's why we're all in this together. Alright, let's go keep going. High potion. And yeah, Ursula can be one who heals. Though honestly. Too bad she can't be in the front too. Like too bad we can't have all of us be in the front. But yeah, that's just not how this game is. Oh yeah, should be just auto attacking actually. Pitching is not that good with the uh, other monks. Yes. But Yang's good. What the ah? Nice. Seven damage. Definitely a waste. It just has a chance. Should be a either save or an item room. Oh. I wonder if I did auto that she'll continuously heal those who have low, lower HP. So I don't have to sit here and choose who gets healed by Chakra. And I do love how they all have like different types of claws. Oh yeah, this is definitely a treasure area. With safe space, of course. It's a moment of truth to see if she heals herself or Yang. I think Yang's just gonna kill everybody. <laughs> you too slow, you're slow. Nice and tent. I should get like two or three treasure chests. Potion. Phoenix down. Fortress. Decoy. Does the automatic thing much? Uh, 
I haven't really been checking to see if uh, Chakra uses MP or not. I've kind of just been letting her use it freely. I can double check. Nope, it doesn't, so we are good. I gotta save. West of Vista. <laughs> it looks like he has a hunchback. Yeah. Alright, she gets to heal this time. Oh yeah. New you again. Hmm, are you all here on training's mission, perhaps? What has it that a falling star landed not far beyond here? If you're here to see it, you should stay on your guard. And speaking of which, would you care for any supplies? Why, well, yes, actually. Uh, what do I need, actually? Here's my drops. Oops. Since they're all uh, physical attack based, you don't want them missing their attacks. Maybe some, uh... Dang, these gold needles are expensive. Right. I'm pretty sure I don't really need money at all. It's really rare that I actually use items. Or actually need the items from the shops. I mean, it's a different story. I'm gonna just give that to Yang. Oh, here he has one. Uh, I guess she can have it, even though she's not really attacking right now, but she will eventually, I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna wish that we can have everybody in the front row. That would have been the best thing. I can pull you. Pretty much don't really want get to get, give anything to uh, the two nameless monks. Again, I have a feeling they're not going to be with us for too much longer. Let's go and save. Do I go too far? There it is. Random meteor or something. Impact crater. Upper wall. Oh wow, it's like a whole dungeon just to get to where the meteor is or whatever. But what is the meaning of this? <laughs> Look at his eyes, it's so intense. Well, Ursula's like just normal. It's as if the land itself has rocked. If only that were all we had to worry about. It's just monsters. I feel intense power nearby. This is not just any normal shooting star. No. Brace yourself for anything. Mount Hobbs could be a mere playground compared to this place. Yes, father. Pow pow. Aya. Because there's four of us now, meaning Ursula joined the party. Antarctic wind. Yeah. <laughs> I love how you have to like stand on these 
yellow whatever to be able to jump up or down. But I'm sure it's again just the way they programmed it. Let's give these guys. Oh, they don't have anything. Let's give them some more defense. Very cool. Pretty sure Yang already has one, huh? Well, oh, he doesn't. Speed. Use my accuracy. Uh, don't really need speed. I might get a chance to confuse. Nah. Unless I'm like explicitly like healing the enemy because of my claws, then I'll switch it. Up and away. <laughs> just like this jump animation looks just hilarious. Oh. Went in a circle. Dang it. That's okay for exploring. I think I'm about to go back to auto attacking. The kick doesn't like obtain the elementals damage. How much do I really want to explore? Is the question. Is there anything about the save area? No. Let's save. Show us why you're the Grandmaster Daddy. Metal Knuckle. Make sure that's pretty good. Yes, there it is. I don't think I really need damage like that, but... Yeah, I'll take it. Avoid the way here is by a treasure chest. 
No. This fire charge just up here. Hopefully there is, otherwise I'm on a wild goose chase for no reason. It's wild goose chase for no reason. Dang it. No, there could have been one, actually. Up in that little middle dip there. Oh well, that's fine. Oh, there's one right there! She's... I'm gonna go back. Go back. Oh, I saw the treasure just right as I was jumping down. I'm surprised I like, missed this one. It's okay, it's only a phoenix down. Ah, I was hoping to get away without having to fight. There's a lot of healing actually, 600 and something. Adamantite. It's supposed to be a boss battle here. It's a random gravestone. Here lies a brave group of monks from the glorious land of Fabul. Oh no! These must be the high monks who left to train on Mount Hobbs. Rest in peace. Mm, that's sad for sure. Bow. Sylphs. Oh yeah, they've been taken over by the uh, mysterious girl. Yank, stay on your guard. You. They've come for us. Oh no. Well, that, they're getting taken over by the Sylphs cave. And they'll come for the crystals next. Wait, of what do you speak? Oh no. What is happening to this world of ours? We must return to Fabul at once. I fear for its safety. Yes, father. Is there a fast way out is the question. Looks like there is. I don't know if there's any more treasure chests. Oh, there's one. High potion. Ah. <laughs> Frog, though. through everything. Hopefully the encounters are low. No sidetrack. Or, uh, no like uh, extra sidewalking or anything. Cause we go back. Oh, I think they uh, made the monsters stronger, right? That's probably a trigger. It would make sense if they did it like that to trigger. Because uh, you would always have to be stronger if you're able to get to the comet or impact site and come back. But nope, they didn't. <laughs> you can tell about how much experience they give us. It's only 57. It's like nothing. So yeah, honestly, I think just the way they set this game up, it's kind of no point of playing new game raw. Because again, you're not really carrying too much over between tales. It's like purely... What is it? Mm, purely, uh, lore? Look at that. It's a bird. 
<laughs> no connection. It's a bird. It's a plane. It's Superman. Baron, right? Yep, yep, bombing. It's the Red Wings. God dang. This is a round two right here. Because they did this again. Ten odd years ago. The Red Wings heading for Fabul. We must hurry. So we get bombed out again. Yeah, sure. Let us go. That's funny. It's kind of like that in real life. Where if you are going somewhere new for the first time, it seems to take like forever to get there. But once you're done and you head home, it's a lot quicker to head home than actually go there. Uh, it's just kind of an interesting uh, occurrence. How that works out. Pretty sure it took a lot longer to get there than me just running back down and <clears throat> heading back to Fabul. Though, I don't have a chocobo this time, so I might encounter some things on the field. Let's see. Uh, <laughs> that was an encounter, but it was just the moon phase changing. Yeah, I think Ursula's actually faster, but it's okay. Before she can cast Chakra. Since I'm not using these other two claws, I should give them to these guys. But it doesn't. It did increase their uh, damage output, it looks like. But it just gave them more elements. I don't know. Maybe it makes them attack twice. Alright, let's go back to the throne room. I'm pretty sure that's where stuff's gonna go down. I have a feeling we're about to meet Cecil up in here. Your Highness, you have returned. The Red Wings are flying this way as we speak. So the rumors about Baron were true all along. So I wonder how they were able to get here faster on foot than airships flying. Interesting. What shall we do, Yang? They are surely after our crystal. Give it to him, right? The wind crystal symbolizes everything Fabul stands for. Handing it over to them is the same as abandoning the kingdom's honor. But Ursula, if we were to fall into a prolonged battle, I fear there would be untold bloodshed. But still, something has happened to Cecil. Of that much, I am certain. Until we know the truth behind it, the crystal must not be surrendered. Father. Your Highness, you wish us to fight back then? No, I shall greet them at the gates and engage matters accordingly. I'm going with you. You should stay with your mom, actually. You will not. Why not? If disaster befalls me, the kingdom will be yours to protect. Your mother needs you, and so do our people. Father... Away again. No. Gather all the bonds. We must ready our defenses at once. Here they come. Hold your attack. We will observe their next move. Welcome to Fabul. 
How is King Cecil? Ah! <laughs> Swoop all the swords on us. Jeez. It's an auto attack because we strong. We strong in numbers. You gonna run away? Yep. Hit <laughs> retreat. Want that? You don't want none of this. Incoming cannon fire is coming from the Red Wings. Back into the castle. Master Yang, our defenses will not hold. Retreat into the castle. Again, a lot of things that happened in the previous game is happening again. I'm about to fight another wave. So it begins anew. Yep. What happened a decade ago is happening all over again. Oh, it's a Lashy, I think it's this enemy's called. Yeah, Lashy. Again, they're just using the same monsters and all that. So. It's all good. Hey, yeah, hey, yeah. So I think I see why the monks like recycle back to level ten. It's because it's just these like nameless monks. Eh, fall back. Well, I mean, we could just fight him again because we're overpowered, but IRL, <laughs> they would have to retreat. Our backs will soon be up against the throne room. Fear not. Sheila has been safely evacuated. What about everybody else? <laughs> pow, pow. Pow, wow. Yay. Yay. <laughs> I think this monk seed like stuck at whatever level he's at. Retreat. Master Yang. Ah. You didn't leave yet? You, why are you still here? To fight alongside you. Not in our party. Okay, KO. To the crystal chamber room now, both of you. What about you? I will stay here. Fight these lushies and stuff. They must be stopped. Father, go. I love how they gave her a really elaborate costume, Ursula, but Sheila, the mom, is still kind of like traditional housewife wear. Yeah. Sorry. I've been scarce lately. It's probably Cecil, right? You. Crystal Chamber. Honey. Oh, the cane. That came to me, yep. So that's definitely Dragoon wear, at least. Kane! What? Are you here to lend us a hand, then? Indeed, I am here to help. Like I did last game. Help myself to the Wind Crystal, that is. Mother, get back. Pretty sure it's scripted, so. I'm just kinda doomed to get a butt beat. Ouch. He does full damage though, but so does he. Oh yes, miss. Oh Yang, out of nowhere. What? Ah. Father. Stay focused, Ursula. Oh 
What if I just switch rows? Nah. Shit, Kane. Ouch. That's pretty good defense. Shit, Kane. Shit like the last game. Yeah, eat it. Let's see. Oh, that's the end of this. Impressive. You are. You what? <laughs> you are. You are. Undoubtedly, your father's daughter. Wait. Oh, your father's daughter, girl. But no matter. Damn, just jumps. No. Oh, it looked like he just attacks the crystal, but he swiped it. Lost the wind crystal. I believe that's the last crystal that they needed. Kane, how could you? Lest you be confused, allow me to assure you that this is not a repeat of the past. I am acting on my own volition. My own free will! Jumps away. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> Dang it, Kane. <laughs> Salty Yang, sitting down throne. In the end, we couldn't stop the wind crystal from being taken to Baron, like last time. Forgive me, it was because of my weakness. The flames of past wars flicker anew. This isn't over. We haven't lost this battle yet, not by a long shot. Ursula. We can take back the crystal. What's wrong with you? We took Rosa, but they didn't hurt her. We just need to rescue her and the crystal. We can take it back too. <laughs> just the same spirit as Rydia. Yes, you're right. Father. Take care of the castle for me. Where are you going, hon? To Baron. Just like we did last time. What? That would be suicide. I must see Cecil about this. I'm coming too. You're staying here. This isn't just for Bull's problem. The entire world is under attack. Huh? Please be careful, Ursula. Sheila. I'm prepared for whatever happens. My duke, please forgive the selfish deeds of your monarch. Quite alright. I'm not too old to serve my kingdom yet. The two of us will keep everything running while you're gone. Thank you. <laughs> so for some reason, for some reason, I felt like that was the end of this uh, chapter, but that's not the case. Uh, okay. Let's go to the world in heels. Not sure how we get to Baron, though. Is there a boat? There was a boat last time, I believe. But I got hit by Leviathan. I wonder if it's going to happen the same way again. That'd be hilarious. Let's see if, Let's see if I can get to the boat. Or if there is a boat up here. Hell yeah, there is. <laughs> Port of a bull. Take care of yourself, Ursula. Give it all you, or give it your all out there. Yes, mother. Smiles. Lenny, er, Lenny. <laughs> Listen, honey. If anything happens to Ursula, I'll make sure you pay for it. <laughs> and it won't just be a frying pan this time. Yes, yes, my dear. Mother? <laughs> Leave the kingdom's affair to us. I shall. Master Yang, Princess Ursula, please come home safely. Again, that's the difference between like his, you know, the past and the present things. Like rulers, I guess. In the past, you know, rulers were the strongest physically, and so you know, in, 
here at Yang is going out to, into the world to do, you know, stuff. While nowadays we have like, you know, just a president or whatever. He's like the figurehead, the political head, but he sends other people out or whatever to do his quote unquote dirty work or the actual legwork. So it's just interesting how things are different because of how uh, it's more civilized society is. But uh, anyways, <laughs> make yourselves at home. It'll be a long journey. We'll take the roundabout path for safety. Raise anchor, man. Aye, aye, sir. Alright. <laughs> Same thing that happened last time. Get hit by a Leviathan. So what will we do once we reach Baron? Attending audience with Cecil and determine the truth behind these affairs. What if Cecil already is in enemy's hands? Ridiculous! That could never happen! Not to Cecil! Sadness. How lucky he is. Huh? You give him so much absolute unwavering trust. I mean, because, like, we went through the trial to become paladin, so, like... Well, he wasn't there for that, but that's what happened, so... Ah! Leviathan Part 2? What is it? Monsters! Oh, just regular. Or, yeah, regular monsters. Punch in the face! Father! Bury yourself, first of all. Just one monster? Is this a boss level? Nope. Just regular monsters. Alright, auto. Auto attack! I've never heard of monsters storming the deck of a ship before. The colorful asks. The moon must be affecting the world's creatures in strange and unpredictable ways. <laughs> what if they just noticed it's two moons? So I believe in the past game, the game ended by one of the moons, like, leaving. Oh, shoot. The rogue ship following us. That's a Demes. Dempsey and crap starboard, Captain. Edward. Haha, <laughs> we're racing her to the docks, he dogs. Hi, hi, sir. Dempsey. Looks like the exact same boat. Damn Edward. <laughs> He's uh, swagged out this time. Is that Yang? King of Dempsey. Edward Chris Von Muir. I really didn't know his name. <laughs> I knew him as Edward. Harley? Who the heck are you? King of Fabul. Secretary of the King of Dempsey. Harley. So it's like a scholar. It's like a scholar class. Yes, you could not find a stronger or gentler monarch, nor one half so brave. Edward, are you sailing for Baron as well? Yes, that's right. Their destination is the same as ours. Indeed, Fabul has picked up on the si same signs we have, no doubt. Ah, what a shot of confidence, knowing that he's on our side. <laughs> Ship kind of broke down out of nowhere. Hmm? We're losing speed. Looks like those monsters did more damage than I thought. Wait. <laughs> did it actually attack the ship? I thought they just attacked it. Don't just sit there. This ship needs some repairs, man. And get to it. Aye, aye, sir. Looks like uh, Edward's gonna get there first. Hopefully, he's alright. Well, 
Sorry to be a bearer of bad news, but it looks like our fuel tank's out of action. What? We've got just enough fuel to reach the closest shore, but not much more than that, I'm afraid. Closest shore? Yep, Adamant Isles. Oh, that's where we got the rat tail and stuff. We made it. Where will we find fuel, though? Some palm oil should work. It's not the best fuel in the world, but it'll do for now. I apologize for being blunt, Captain, but we are on urgent business. Let's just get what we need and get moving again. Remember that this is unexpected or unexplored island, so there's no telling what's out there. Then I'll go. Father, I'm coming too. You will wait here. It's like, God damn it, Father. <laughs> Let us go with you, Master. Enough worrying about me. I'll be back in a short time. Be careful. Mm hmm. You stay here with the ship while I go do something reckless. <laughs> well, we can, like, see him run all the way off of the uh, ship there. Uh, quit your wearing. This is Master Yang we're talking about. I hope there won't be any more trouble. You need to stay here, Princess. The forest can be a dangerous thing at night. I'm worried about Master Yang. His strength is beyond question, but he's still by himself out there. We keep our stores down here below decks. It's probably like items and stuff. And yeah, a save point. No, there's items. There is no items. Wow. What a tease. No items whatsoever. Oh well. Let's see. Alright. It'd be wise to rest for a little, princess. You can't push yourself too hard at times like these. If you want to take a rest, just let me know. Merchant. Metal knuckle. Sure. So we don't need anything. I want armor. Headband for damage, I believe. Some armor for. We get headband. Because I know it increases strength. I can use this to offset. So we don't need anything. Headband for damage. Of armlet for more. Oh, actually, just keep the power armlet. Go full damage, bros. Fight against machines. Just damage. Net damage. Let's go and save again, actually. I should have. Well, I didn't know that there was a shop here. But I'm gonna save my purchases. Not that it matters, actually. But, you know, whatever. It's been done. I think I'm gonna try to leave. I don't know if I like, I, like have to sleep. But well, there's nothing over here. So I'm gonna try to leave and look for Mr. Yang Man. Nope, they're not gonna let us. Maybe. Father. Pretty sure I can just leave, come back, and sleep if I needed to, and keep going. Don't worry, Mr. Yang will be back before you know it. I wonder if I should have bought another headband for when I do uh, meet up with Yang again. I'm going. I'm out, bitch. If I can go back, I'm gonna go ahead and buy stuff. Princess Ursula, let's come with you. I'm gonna buy a headband for everybody. Oops, too late. No, they're gonna get back. And yeah, I'm not gonna reload. It's whatever. Let's go. How far in did my father go in? Shouldn't really be spun like this that much, but need this treasure. Cottage. Breaks down. 
I wonder if I should put her on the front lines. Uh, we'll see how this first battle goes. If I can just auto attack with everybody and be fine, then I'll just leave it as is. Otherwise, I think I'll put Ursula on the front. She probably does more damage than all these other monks. I feel like that's probably the best arrangement actually. But I'll go ahead and switch to see what happens. I say that because um, I guess you if you're in the back row and you do melee damage, you do reduce damage. But putting on one of the mogs who are very weak in the back pretty much means uh, he'll do pretty much negligible damage, so he's kind of like a tank at that point, just taking damage from him. Like that. But since putting uh, Ursula in front allows her to one shot the soul guys, I forgot the name of her, that particular enemy is. I guess it's okay that she's up front, but the thing is, hey, I'm auto attacking, so they just attack in order of the monsters. And so if she can one hit, but all the other monks like wail on the same enemy. And once it gets to her turn, it's like she just one shots it anyways. And then just wastes the attacks of all the other guys. And, but again, it's because I'm not like manually targeting and all that, so just let it rock. So I kinda knew there was nothing down here. But, like there's a high percent chance of nothing being down here. Because it's a safe point, but I went for it anyways. Maybe I don't have to fight. Flash of Baku. Well, I best get things going for dinner. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. What is it? Hot Prago, son. <laughs> oh, nothing. You look pale, my dear. I'm fine. I'm not sick or anything. I'm just Prago, my dear. <laughs> then what? Hehe, <laughs> it's a child, our child. <laughs> what? Aren't you happy? Uh, of course I am. <laughs> That's funny. That's one way to uh, get the news broken to you. Adam and Isle Forest. There's a pot to drink. And restore our HP and MP. Oh, it's Yang. Hmm. Further in, perhaps? Oh, perhaps further in. I wonder what's drawing him to be here. Oh, he already had a feather cap, so yeah, it didn't matter. Yep, maybe I, I could have bought another metal knuckle, but it's alright. Just get in there. Uh, honestly, I kind of just want to go. Like, I don't really care too much about collecting this stuff. I don't think I need it. But alas, I am pulled in by treasure hunting. I don't know if I'm even gonna level up. I feel like this is how he leveled up past Ursula, because he's by himself. I would kick, but. Maybe I should kick, actually. Pretty, pretty much only the red one is probably the one that's doing the most, or has the most HP, too. So. Yeah, nope. 
happens if you kick twice then hopefully it just kills the two green ones. Oops. Auto attack. Oh, it just kills them all. So two kicks kills them all. I'm not sure if I should keep double kicking. Oh. Silver breastplate. Oh. Uh, it's not enough extra defense to take away the uh, offense. It's just double kicking. It should kill everybody, I think. Oh, because they have like 130 HP. Pretty sure this is what I did the first time I played this too. Because why waste items and stuff when you just use a interactable to heal yourself? Uh, more flashbacks. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I'm pretty sure Ursula is probably like, watching and she wants to like be with her dad. But of course Master Yang is busy training monks and being the king or whatever. Master Yang! Hmm? What? Won't you even take a day off like this? A oh, day like this off? Training exists especially for days like this. Assuming your mind is in it, that is. True, Yang's probably preoccupied about having a kid. Duke. She'll be giving birth any moment now. Go now and be by her side. But. Oh. And that's the thing, too. Uh, especially back then, in like the older days. Uh, pretty sure there's a lot of times where the mother does pass because of childbirth but nowadays we have you know medical you know, technology and all that to prevent most of the uh, birthing complications that might happen so yeah you should definitely be by your side of your waifu when she's giving birth to your kid let's see uh and loses everything. Right, I'm just gonna go straight for the the goal here. It's gonna take too long. If I uh, go everywhere. I wonder if there is a shortcut though. To the forest. Have to go a long windy way. Weakness. Oh, I didn't die. That sucks. So Ursula would have one-shotted it if uh, she was in the front row, and then the other the other monks will just mess around with it because they're too weak. I know they do it because. Um, what I mean is like Ursula being stronger than the nameless monks because because um, she's an actual character, right? So she has to be stronger than the nameless monks. <laughs> I'm gonna have to have oh no, I'm gonna have to have Ursula do some chakra on some dudes. We're running low on HP. Yay. Looks like that monk is out of sync with the other two monks.
Yeah, ha, ha. Yeah, yeah. Damn, she has some hands, though. Pretty quick. Ooh, nice work, Ursula. Really? Really? So can I be big and strong like you someday, Daddy? Oh, of course, of course. Yippee! But remember, Ursula, there's something I want you to cherish even more than that. Uh-uh. No way. I want to be big and strong like you, Daddy. <laughs> like, mm, <laughs> can uh, change a woman's mind. At least not that easily. Oh, that's why. Yeah, at night, everyone's attack is uh, lowered, but this auto attack should be good. Yeah, and honestly, though, it's not the uh, time of day, it's the phase of the moon that changes uh, how the uh, attack magic. Is, uh, I don't know what you want to call it, but whether or not to get buffed or debuffed. I'm just going to go straight to the exit because I don't need nothing. I feel like Ursula is only like two levels behind, so. It's all good. Huh? Whack. When are you going to start giving Ursula her formal training? Never! <laughs> Not until she understands it for herself. Oh, jeez. Understands what for herself? Kindness. Honor. She is kind. And where could you find a more honorable young lady? True enough, but she still yearns for strength above everything else in her life. Everything? This, coming from you, I say what's good for the goose is good for the gander. <laughs> Interesting uh, idiom there. She's my daughter. My one and only daughter. Okay. So we gotta match up yet? Or uh, meet up yet? Oh yeah, I need our sled to start shoppering. Should be able to heal the whole party because it's gonna take forever to kill these guys. The damage that these bugs are doing, which is kind of silly, but oh well. Pretty much just gonna take one round to kill one. <coughs> Maybe I won't be able to heal them all. I'm actually doing more damage than I thought I was. That's fine. Actually. Oops. A little roll down. Just depend with everybody. Go ahead and make sure I heal everybody. I should have waited, waited, waited. Oh, well. They're pretty much healed, right? <laughs> We're leveling up, son. Yes. So interesting enough. It's not necessarily a debate per se, but it's just a interesting idea that. So there's pretty much being very strong, so that you can actually attack quickly. Or not, whatever time. So you can actually attack once and then just do a bunch of damage. But then there's also being fast, and so it's, it's, your you know attacks aren't doing that much damage. But if you can do multiple attacks in like a short time, then um, it pretty much makes up for the damage that you didn't 
do the first time. I don't know if that makes sense. But attacking multiple times could add up to be the same damage if you attack one time, but then you're slow to attack again. So I wonder if that's kind of what they're doing with the different uh, uh, damage or stats increase for the different months. Because month A and month B, though we had them the most, they are increasing in stats differently than each other. I love how Ursa has to like <laughs> run forever. Just so just imagine Yang already ran through this uh, part of the woods already. <coughs> Granted, he didn't explore anything, but he did walk this way. Yeah. Her soul levels up. And she's only one level behind Yang now. Yeah, I was talking with a friend and like, grinding isn't so bad if the grinding process is actually between fun and fast. So if you're just sitting there grinding forever <laughs> and it's like, just to get one level, then you know, you kind of get burned out from trying to grind so much. But if you uh, have it fun, then it's not as noticeable that you're sitting there grinding. And uh... Definitely back then, they didn't really employ too much of a way to have it uh, fun to grind. But uh, I guess as time went on, you have places that are easy to level up and stuff like that. But of course, you know, you just, in a normal RPG, you just progress to further uh, levels, and then you would, you know, kind of level up fast to get to the threshold in which the XP is coming in. Um, but I think the way this game's set up, you don't really have that kind of ability to do so. Because <laughs> you're always start fighting against the same group of enemies. They're not that... Uh, they don't give that much experience. So you'll be here forever. Only unless you, know, you have some party members die, but again, you want everyone to level up, so you don't want anybody to die. Or get knocked out. Mm -hmm. So you see, I do it the old fashioned way. So I kind of wonder if I should have it so all the monks kick to do, you know, distributed damage, and then Ursa just comes in and one shots whoever she's attacking. That might be. A Good strategy, but I'm pretty much done with this uh, tail, I believe. So, so late for that. Use the tent. fighting this mob. Because the spirits are like very annoying to fight. They don't take like huge amounts of damage. <clears throat> but uh, as long as our stuff can kind of dispatch them pretty quickly, that's alright. Wow. 
<laughs> and then these zombies do like massive damage to my party. That's okay. Just suck it up. Level up. Ooh, they all leveled up. Well, they're all like kind of balanced out now. Right? So A and B are off by, or A and B are the same. Yep. And then C is actually ahead, right? Yeah. That's interesting. So you think they kind of keep it the same for us? But I guess it really depends how much you grind. Um, during the first half of this tale. I haven't seen treasure chests in so long. tree. Palm trees, this ought to be enough. Oh, Yang say that? Nope. Something's coming. Hmm? Oh, it's another one of these turtles from the... You really have to fight one of these? Agar tortoise. Princess, stay back. We'll handle this. Scripted, because only did one damage. Scripted. Oh, dang. Just eat all of us, huh? This is bad news. Daddy. Where are you, Daddy? One inch punch? Nope. I'm just wailing at this rock. How did I get this rock in here? <laughs> nice try. What? Is that all? Sorry, we can't break this rock. This is impossible, Master Yang. It's just too hard. Trying to crush it through sheer force will only serve to bruise your knuckles. Every object has a weak point. Find it. Concentrate upon it. Oh, Yang's gonna one-inch punch this thing. Oh yeah! <laughs> and you no longer need to exhaust your strength. <laughs> it's like, impossible. They're still watching. It's like, I want to be just like you, Daddy. You're so strong. <laughs> She's like, oh my lord. But she heard the training word, so that's all she needs. Just gotta break this turtle. I'll try my best. To get to. Oh, yeah. Nice. Break that armor. Oh, yeah. Father. Yeah, keep your eyes on the enemy. Yeah, we can use a band move. Let's do it. Oh, this is MP. Five star crimson palm strike. That's it. How, uh. Oh, shit. Dang. I don't know what happened to it. Slow down that. We're gonna use another one. We strong. Oh, this one. 
chest you know, pincer attack or something. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Double kick. Yes sir, double kick. Mmm. Looks so good. Not dead yet though. It ain't dead yet. Let's do the other one again. Five palms. Whatever. He can be dead. He's uh, slightly over leveled, or like has more XP than uh, Monkey and B. <laughs> I love that. Dead. <laughs> These retro uh, boss death animations are pretty funny. Dematerialize into the ground. Yep, that's about right. Mm. Alright, team palm oil for the oil tanks. First, I learned to get it. Now she's down for the count. Well done. <laughs> Yang's the only one standing. Cause he's a hard ass father. You always had strength, but now it is affirmed by your the heart. A heart to save your companions in need. I only carried out what you taught me to do, Father. From this moment on, consider yourself my newest disciple. <gasps> you mean... Don't expect, uh, expect special treatment, though. Not even my own daughter is allowed that luxury. Father... <laughs> Wah. Oh, I thought she didn't hug him. Spare me your tears. I am no longer your father. I am now master to you. <laughs> yes, master. That's pretty funny. Off to Baron then. Yes, master. You learn the twin wind frenzy bang. Wait. I thought I already knew that. So I used it like I used it once. Oh, good stuff. Oh, I have to go all the way back. And we're dead. Dang it. Let's see. Right, I'll just do that. Uh, actually, let's see. Let's put Ursula and Yang up front. Oops. Let's see. Yeah, that works, I guess. Let's put her up here. Okay, hang up there. Not sure, whatever. All right, let's go. I just have to go all the way back. All the way. Of course, the uh, enemies would be a lot easier now that Yang's also in the same party. But it just takes forever. Until uh, we're fully healed, I'm gonna go ahead and just try for everybody. Because I do like how in these uh, kind of remastered slash ported versions of this game and Final Fantasy IV that if you die or like I guess some catastrophe happens, I think you're able to just continue where you left off. So it kind of has like a mini autosave feature. Of course, I might just be thinking it wrong, and I think it only does that for battles. Like if you die, you get wiped for a battle, 
You don't have to restart from where you saved. You can restart from right before the battle. Which is pretty nice, I guess. But I don't know if that same thing will work if, uh, say, your game crashed or something. Luckily, I can't find it. I jinxed it, but I haven't really found any issues quite yet. Playing. Treasure here. I'll try to skip, skip things. I don't even go down then. The party is treasure just that way though, but it's good. So get out of here. Get me out of here. Let's see if Yank can kick. Don't have I do enough damage to kill things. Attack is up. It is waxy move. Man, we're in the back row. I take like a little damage. The other thing I don't like about fighting big mobs and enemies, they just they all attack and like I mean, it slows us down. Trying to not kill everybody. Not even have to kill the zombie in the back. It's like to like run all the way to one of the exploration spots and have nothing there. <clears throat> or even then just having like a simple item there like potion or uh, ether or something. Especially because our units don't really use MP all that much. They only use it if I'd use a band skill but otherwise <clears throat> no one uses MP really. Imagine if you took the time to actually level everyone up <laughs> to max level in these tails. Because these tails, again, they don't last long. And so you don't really gain all that experience, much experience. So it'll be horrible <laughs> trying to level up all the way. have like full on armor or not, but doesn't matter. Pretty much want to get back to the ship, I believe the tail's all over. Just gotta get there. Man, <laughs> I feel like I've been walking for days. It's probably only been like five, ten minutes, but in these encounters, they definitely burn your time. Especially so you don't die right away. Because at least during, you know, Theodore's campaign, or Tail, when I was doing the New Game Plus for it, like, he was super overleveled, so he can pretty much one-shot stuff. We're pretty much in that, uh, level now, but... Even then, before, we weren't really one-shot anything, so we just had to use multiple people to attack. 
Oh, it turns the morning. Alright. Oh, where is everybody? Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say, where is everybody? Master Jiang, Princess, you've all come back safely. Will this work for you? Hand it over palm oil. Amazing work, my liege. I need no thanks. My people did all the work. People? I have been accepted as Master Yang's newest disciple. Princess. Please, call me Ursula. Is there anything I can help you with? Or do to help? Well, if you're offering. I'll need help refining this palm oil into usable fuel. Can you lend a hand? Sure. Nice. Now on to Baron. Something like it's supposed to happen so it becomes a cliffhanger. I feel like that is the way they're doing it. So, you, know, you go through the whole tale and then cliffhanger happens. On board. This is some high quality oil. We'll be at the gates of Baron in a blink of an eye. Unless the Vyathan hits. Oh, Master. What is it? I feel a tremendous sense of foreboding ahead of us. So you've noticed it too. Yes. Lash yourselves to the ship. Yep, the Vyathan's coming. What? Now, do it. Yes, your highness. This dread, I feel. Leviathan. I knew it. Oh, whirlpool. Even worse. So you like slowly go to your demise. <laughs> Yeah, there's that cliffhanger I was talking about. That should be the end. Yep. Yeah, that's pretty, uh... Pretty fun little tale. Yeah, they pretty much made these are like all side quests, more or less. But... Yeah, that's the end of Master Yang's tale. And, you know, eventually they all, like, converge into the final tale, I believe. So, yeah. It very seems... or very seems it seems very short and sweet but I think it's just how they wanted to do this game uh, again it's pretty much like a super epilogue to the first game and yeah 